Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Fleur Nell and today I am bringing you my first Funko Pop video. So I thought we'd start off with who I think is my favourite anime character even though I haven't come to terms that they're my favourite anime character. So we're starting with All Might and the collection I have. So let's stick around and we shall see the amount that I have. <laughs> Okay, so I don't really know exactly where to start because I have just that many. So, um, hmm, I think what we'll do is we'll start with the non-Funko Pop ones first and then we'll go into the Funko Pop ones afterwards. So the very first one that I have is an actual figure from All Might. So this one is the Age of Heroes All Might that I have, if I could get rid of the glare. <laughs> Um, so this one I have had for a while. I think I got this one while I was in Scotland. I can't remember. Basically, once I started collecting all my it just went downhill from there. So this one is the only one that I actually keep out of box because um, you can't really see it through the packaging. So this is the only one that has packaging that um, covers all four sides. So this is the yeah the only one that is out of box. So this is the one that I have here. As you can see, we are matching. <laughs> Um, yes, I have a skirt that goes with the bottom half that also has like this pattern on it and then yellow at the bottom. So yeah, so this one comes with a stand and as you can see, a little, little bit dusty because um, he's been out for a while. So this is the first one that I've got. So this one I have to say is pretty damn cool in the All Might in his pose. Um, it's very well done and very well put together. So yeah, I usually keep this one just on the box and that's the way I usually have it displayed. So um, yeah, this one wasn't too expensive to be fair. Um, but there's a lot of All Might figures out there considering he doesn't actually fight. So um, yeah, the Age of Heroes one I definitely enjoy. Now the first um, the first one that I got I think locally down here, um, same, same pose, exact same pose, is another All Might. However this one I keep in the box because obviously you can see him through the box. Um, amazing packaging I mean just just look at it because he's still still in there he's not coming out anyone that has a sticker on it they're just not coming out unfortunately so yeah this is the second one that I have the exact same pose um, which I got from down here I can't exactly I think I got this one as a gift because I can't remember purchasing this one because anyone who knows me knows if you get me something all my then you know that's it so yeah this one here is also oh my goodness can I actually get it in the frame this one here is one of my favorites as well as I said just love the uh, sizing of it as well and just looking at it inside the box as well that one is a great one um, so yeah I think this one I, I said I'm not too sure how much that one cost because I don't think I bought that one um, same with the next one that I've got as well so the next one that I've got is this one here now again this one oh this one doesn't actually have a sticker on it okay that's fine because this one I hadn't taken out of the box but as you can see um, in the packaging I did get this one for Christmas that one of the hands is missing um, which is actually at the bottom of the box so the hand is in here and um, this one's slightly smaller than the other ones in comparison um not by not by much though to be fair um but yeah and um, all in the same outfit like this is why everyone says i have a problem but yeah i really do like this this all my this one has more joints to it though so it's got more movability as you can see the hands on it are interchangeable as well um so yeah i do like this one i got this one as well as a christmas present again the packaging is just so cute um, you can't go wrong with all my and anything my hero academia to be honest anyway so yeah i think that is all of the non-funko ones let me just double check no there's one more um this one i just got from tokyo toys this was a cute little one i was just like just look how adorable that is i mean anything chibi is adorable anyway just just look how tiny it is comes with a little bento and a little drink as well so yeah i do love this one um again still in the box um, and then there's ones that you can collect as well around it so i'm collecting the other ones as well and um, this video is strictly all might at the moment so yeah but i do like this one again cute packaging pretty much anything all might if i see it i gotta have it so yeah but yeah i don't think this one was expensive as well um, as i said i got this one from tokyo toys so that one was just a cute little one um, which i kept now the very first all might that i got um is the original all might 
as you can see, <laughs> I'm just like literally showing the safety, like all of them have been in the superhero suit so far. So this is the first Funko Pop that I've got. So again, as you can see, just your, your standard Funko Pop packaging, 248 on here, obviously you've got the other ones that you can collect, which I'm still in the process of collecting as well. Um, so yeah, just all my in his outfit, you can't go wrong. I do love the designs that they've got on the Funko Pop ones. I think that they proportioned it very well. So um, yeah, this is the first one I got. And then once I got one, I needed all of them. So um, on to the next one. The next one is my favourite one, which is all my in his teacher outfit. I do love the yellow suit. I mean, not many people can pull off a yellow suit. Like, let, let's be honest. So yeah, I've got this one. This one's actually 604. Um, so yeah, when All Might's in his teacher mode and like he um, tells Deku that, uh, Deku that he got in, honestly, it's just one of my faves. So there, as you can see, some of the others. I've got a few of these. I think I'm only missing two of these actually on the back. Um, yes, yeah, so I've got a few of these ones. I'm going to do a My Hero video of the ones that I've got next and just combine it with some of the other ones because I've got like loads of mishmash Funko Pops. So yeah, definitely one of my favourites. So I love that one. Um, the third one is the Silver Age All Might. Um, I do like this one. This one's quite cute. Um, the only thing with this one that I found, it was just like some of the detailing around the painting around his outfit. I'm not sure if you can see it. But that's the only thing that I have sort of like a little sort of bugbear with this one is just like the little detail on this one. But this one's still a really good one. Um, so yeah, the Silver Age All Might. So you have to get one of him obviously with his previous outfits. As I said, I've got quite a few because the teacher outfit one is in here as well. So this one is 608. Um, so again, another favourite of mine. Um, now, Skinny All Might as well, I'm a big fan of. So I've got the Weakened All Might as well with him in his skinny form. I think that the design of this is really cool. The way that they've done it, obviously, with the proportion size of the Funko Pops. I do like the way that they've done um, the way he is. He's tried to make his like shirt baggy on him as well and stuff like that, which is really cool. So, um, yeah, we've got the Weakened All Might, as you can see, with his hair, with his bangs at the front. Um, and yeah, 371 this one, but yeah, I do I do like this one. So yeah, I mean, I like all of them. What can I say? I didn't think I was a, a huge All Might fan and he was my favourite character until it turns out I have everything All Might. Now, the next one I have is actually in um, a protective box as well. So this one I got as a gift. Um, so this one is All Might Weakened in his superhero outfit, which is also limited edition. I don't know if you can see it because of the glare. Um, because it glows in the dark as well. So this was legit one of the best Christmas presents I've ever got. Like honestly, when my friend got me this, I was legit like, <gasps> so you, you knew the vibes, you knew the vibes. So yeah, this one is definitely one of my favorites. So yeah, I've no idea where they got it from, how much they paid or anything like that for a limited edition one. But yeah, this one is definitely up there, which is why this one stays in the packaging that it's in. Like it's, it's just never come out the box. Like there's only a couple that I've taken out the box, like just once. And the original All Might that I got, I took out the box. And the next one that I got, I also took out the box. Actually, the one I was safe to the end, I took out the box. Um, so yeah, then we got the um, minis that they do as well because Funko Pop clearly weren't taking enough of my money. So we have two of the key rings. Now I did have a Silver Age key ring that broke. Um, so I bought a new one to keep in box, but I did actually have the All Might key ring on my keys and then it was just like a poor little head after my brother had him. So we've got the Silver Age All Might key ring, if we can get some focus. There we go. So yeah, it's just a cute little version of uh, the Silver Age All Might. So as you can see, they've got like cute little packaging on the um, little pocket pop keychains and then I've got him in his weakened form. I haven't seen him in his regular superhero outfit but I haven't looked um, recently because I've just been, I spent far too much money on Funko Pops recently as you'll see from this series that we're doing but yeah so we got this one. I think I got one of these in um, the Primark in Birmingham where they started doing Funko Pops. I'm pretty sure I got one of them in there. Um, so yeah, love the keychains. I do need to buy another keychain back so I can keep him on my key rings, um, which is one of my um, favourites. So I do like the Silver Age as well. And then the final one, which is the one that I took out of the box once and never again, is the large All Might. Now this, when I got this as a Christmas present, I asked my brother for it and he legit had no idea what he was paying for. And then when he got the delivery, he was like, if I'd have known it was that big, I never would have purchased it. I was like, see, this is, this is how you finesse the system. So yeah, this one is my favourite. This one is absolutely dope. Just look at the size of it. So yeah, this is the, I believe 10 inch are the size of the big ones. 
Um, so this is the 10 inch All Might Funko Pop. As you can see, just the exact same regular um, packaging on there. If we can get the glare off. Um, as you can see, exactly the same on the back as um, some of the other ones as well, just with the ones to collect and the numbers. Um, so yeah, this one, honestly, one of my faves. So um, when I actually total it, I have one, two, eleven All Mites. So we, we have we have eleven of this guy, but I mean, he, he's just one of the best characters. Like honestly, even in his weakened form, I always had to take a step back. He's still one of my favorite characters, especially when he came in. So um, yeah, definitely love this one. So I took this one up the first time just to have a look at it. I mean, I am the type of person that would purchase another one just so I can keep one out the box and one in the box, but we haven't quite reached it to that level yet. And I think I would receive a lot of judgment for um, keeping them out the box as well as in the box, because I do love the packaging that they do have on them um, as well. But yeah, the, the All Might is in a different pose. To the small ones as you can see the small one he's got his hands on his waist in the original superhero form whereas in this one he's in like a more of an action pose um, with one hand behind and one hand reaching out in front so there are slight differences to the two between the small one and the big one so they, they aren't exactly the same i mean come on like duh <laughs> so yeah these two then are slightly different so as much as all of mine pretty much have this pose um together this one is slightly different so I mean you can't complain too much can you you know he teaches you to plus ultra and go further you know saving people with a smile so um yeah these are my, my moment's favorites like honestly I'm such a big All Might fan um so I absolutely love these so yeah I was thinking to take them all out of box and then put them back in box for the video but I'm not too sure so if you want to see that let me know just give me enough time to prepare to you know mentally be prepared to take them out to put them back in i mean honestly i legit take them out have a look at them go, <gasps> and then put them straight back in um for the few of them that i have taken out of the box not that these are like collectible collectibles but some of them depending on what funko pops you have and depending if they're discontinued or not if they're vaulted some of them do then get you know more um value to them that's the word i was thinking of yeah but um yeah this is my first video of my first uh, haul of Funko Pops so we're just going to do like a little series of all the ones I've got because I've got so many and they're still ongoing I've got so many pre-orders as well so um yeah if you like this video thumbs up and make sure to subscribe um, and keep following for the content and I'll catch you on the next video